all right guys what's going on db here so i'm gonna run through some of these high apy platforms i'm on um i'm also going to talk about some of the ones that i stumbled upon um just general research purposes really for anybody um but originally when i started making these crypto videos i talked about you know the basics of it having a twitter an online presence following people that are in the same investments in you and i did mention how this isn't just your run-of-the-mill altcoins these are utility coins they serve some purpose there's staking behind it there's nodes behind it you're uploading files you're running transactions things of that nature so some of the platforms i'm on olympus you can find that at olympusdow.finance i'm actually right now i'm inside of the actual app but their website olympusdow.finance this is i want to say not the original but a lot of a lot of the high staking platforms are clones of olympus they're you know they got their github repo and whatnot and it was they weren't the first ones to do it but they're one of the ones that did it the best ways for the most part um but again the apy 8300 you're not gonna you know banks do what like 0.5 percent apy one percent apy you know you're talking about 8000 apy when you go to um wonderland it's another olympus clone 6600 um Klima DAO, which i posted a video on it's in the last time i checked because i really don't check these which is what i like about these platforms i don't have to check them every day like if you've been seeing my videos on smart i have to check this thing every day they got us that is literally the squid games of crypto they have us like look here like effective immediately users that don't sell get a hundred percent reward when we launch this swap event on the 30th so now Again, I was never going to sell. That was never my intentions. I wanted to build up because Smart R was already announced. But basically, they're saying, now you guys can't sell, which, again, it is what it is. They want the price to hold up. But they got you doing a whole bunch of stuff. You know, anybody who joins at this point, obviously, now, um, you don't qualify for the 100% because you could just join last minute. So they predicted that. But, again, this is not the platforms I'm talking about. This is, like, I don't want to say a Ponzi scheme. I enjoy the platform. I think the memes are hilarious. But the platforms I'm on, Olympus, Time, Klima Dow, all of those, they're real laid back. It's just, you know, and that's, you just research the projects, you know, high APY, staking. They got the bonds, the whole 3-3. Three, three. All these platforms have that. And it, you'll actually notice that they all kind of look similar. You see here, return on investment, five-day rate. Um, and I actually, um, I just recorded a video before this doing the projection math on this. Um, but if you notice, they all have the year balance, your state, the next reward. Olympus DAO has the same thing. Klima DAO, if I enter the app, I think I have to switch the Polygon network here. Yeah, switch the main net. Sure. I'll just switch for you. Yeah, sure, whatever. Uh, see, they got the same thing here. Time till next rebase, all that. But basically the same thing. Um, and their APY is at 31,000. Again, ridiculously high APYs. Leave your money in there for however long you want. The general math, I believe, is in because the APY on a on Olympus has gone down because sustainability and whatnot. But I believe it's on Olympus. It's either 50 days your money doubles or 75 days now that their APY dropped. But these other ones, like I haven't even done the math, that which is why I'm making the, that app that I was talking about in the other video to really calculate what are you going to earn in two months three months if you stake on this i think that'll be a very useful tool again there is excel sheets for that but um that's basically what i wanted to cover in this video because if you know you're new to the channel or you're new to crypto and you're seeing the smart thing and how toxic and volatile it is yes extremely day trading and altcoins extremely volatile um projects like smart coin it's not for new people in crypto you're going to lose your mind you're going to make mistakes but platforms like Olympus, Time, Klima, it's real laid back. You just, you know, you follow the tutorial to grab the coin, you stake the coin, and you just let it sit there and marinate for a few months. And then, you know, you do your cashing out or whatever. Like, there's more math behind it than that. Because, you know, in Olympus, for example, um, where is it? Right here. Um, let me switch. So I had, I originally, I did some very basic math where I realized that if you own three Olympus or three Ohm, you generate one ohm in 25 days and then at that point you have four ohm and now you're generating another fifth ohm on the on tw in 20 days so that the days drop and drop and drop and drop the more ohms you have till eventually you know you're making like five a month or something of that nature um i've never took it past eight 
because it was just I had like eight calculators open and I just and that was when I was like I need to make an app this is annoying you know but I did that bare minimum math and I got that but yeah again um one of the platforms I recently heard about gyro.money uh koji farms or koji farms and there's a lot of these platforms out there you really just need to get on twitter you really need to join some of these discord groups like if you come to discord uh let me hide mine currently because i'm not really trying to put anyone out there or whatever but an example a good example is srx um this was an investment i i joined i made a lot of money i actually made my most money from srx and i invested in all these other platforms but in the off topic, this is literally where I met all the people in my Discord group. They all posted projects here. And then, you know, one thing led to another. And we're like, hey, we should create a server for this so we could all, like, really, you know, have the different channels instead of one giant off topic. We have these dedicated channels. And then um, the same thing here on Strong. Strong's got, you know, they've got all sorts of things in here, like different channels. There's usually always an off topic one. Um, general, well, I don't know exactly where it is because I'm not really very active in the strong one. But again, that's usually how it goes. You follow these people on Twitter that are investing in various projects, posting about them. You make friends in Discord, and you know you guys lead each other on. And that's more or less what this video is about. I guess it's a uh, part two to that basics of crypto because I was really just more or less talking about the utility coins and what they do and stuff. But this is more about the whole staking platform, these high APY projects the farms and all that it's a little different than trading in altcoins day trading investing and holding in shiba inu and things like that you're actually earning it's like a savings account you're actually earning for putting money in here um i don't know what it costs smart honestly smart was supposed to be like that when i first saw it i thought it was like oh high apy that's pretty good you know your stake you're earning daily but then that whole squid games thing through <laughs> through a whole loop and everything but yeah guys Again, do your research, find these projects, have an online presence, be wary of scams, don't give anybody your wallet details. If somebody messages you, take everything they say with a grain of salt and I don't even reply when people message me unless like I know them from the server and we've had, you know, conversations and maybe they're just asking a question or maybe I ask a question and they DM me and things like that. But yeah, that's about it for this video. I really am just trying to teach people about these platforms, sort of, you know, put put the word out there because I was investing in altcoins for like six months and you're like I did make some money I lost more money than I, I ever made on that um Shiba Inu is now just making me money like six months after I invested in it but again um you know just have fun try to find these projects again I, I talked about my discord in the last video um and it will be open to the public eventually I, I really just want to sort of create some sort of structure now um because i do want to avoid having to help people one-on-one -on -one. that's you know the tutorials the youtube channel yeah i'll help you guys one-on-one -on -one. you can shoot me a message i'm not really trying to have a discord because there's like a lot of other people in there that are you know finding projects for us and we're all so, you know, sort of scratching each other's back so i wouldn't want to um, sort of impose on them and have them help a bunch of noobs sorry to call you that but it is what it is anyways guys i do hope you like the content catch you guys later